The sun is just rising in South Philadelphia, but already Joey Vento, owner of Gino's Cheesesteaks, and a few employees are hard at work preparing for the day. I opened up in 1966. I had a $2,000 investment, and when I actually opened up, I had $6 in cash. The product now that you pay $8 for was 45 cents at that time. And uh, I built it one customer at a time. Here it is 43 years later. Uh, they don't laugh anymore. Like a lot of times I'll say, what was the biggest celebrity who was here? Well, I have to say Joey Vento because they're <laughs> coming here to see me and work, make a sandwich off of my grill. So I got to say I'm the biggest celebrity that's ever been here. Gino's Cheesesteak has become a staple in Philadelphia, especially after a Phillies game. It's the best. It is the best. It's the best in town. Kills Pats. I come to Gino's because it's got the original Philly cheesesteak. I'm looking for an authentic experience in Philadelphia. It's not overpowering. Everything's balanced. There's just enough cheese, meat, onions. Everything's good. Gino's popularity has created an opportunity to share his political perspective. Uh, you want to get on? Let's take a little subject like is illegal immigration, which I'm so dead against. I want every illegal out of this country. First of all, Let's start off with this anchor baby they call. That means you come over here, pop a baby out, and it's an American citizen, even though you're illegal. I say pick it up and take it back with you. And we have one language, which is the English language. So I, I took the English, and the sign basically what it says, when order, please speak English. It doesn't demand anything, but you are in our country. It seems like what they tell me, I, put, I united a country because of the speak English. Now, how hard it is it to learn to say cheesesteak? Although Joey Vento doesn't plan on giving up the cheesesteak business for politics, he still has his son and 26 legal employees to run the shop while he's out doing press events. For Temple News, I'm Stacy Naughton. It's nice to be loved and, mm -hmm. and feared, but if I had a choice, I'd take fear, because love doesn't last as long as fear.